Welcome back, and as promised, I always say that kind of like a magician. Like, he's just appeared. <laughs> and just Steve hearing. from Wine in the Fine Teachers <laughs> Poof came upon us. Uh, and we were just talking about this really great event this weekend. You know, despite all the snow, I know that's exciting for everyone, but we're more looking forward to Wine in the Pines. That's right. And it's not this weekend. It's coming up on the 19th and 20th of October. That's not this weekend. Oh my no, it's gosh, not. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I feel, push, I'm just like so excited. <laughs> you know, everyone's getting really pumped. So we still have two weeks to prepare ourselves and our taste buds for everything that's going to be at Wine in the Pines. Go ahead, let us all know. What, what do you expect in two weekends? Two okay. weeks from now, on 19th and 20th of October, we will hold and host the 35th annual Wine in the Pines event at Keystone Resort. I'm not sure there's many benefits that have ever uh, had 35 annual events at one place at yeah, Keystone. Yeah, I was going to say 35. That's 35. a big one. It'll be at the Keystone Conference Center. Our winemakers dinner is on Friday night the 19th and then we have the Wine in the Pines uh, sampling over 500 wines. We will have uh, food tasting from all of our exclusive restaurants from Ski Tip to the Alpenglow Stew Bay to the Keystone Ranch. Uh, every one of our restaurants will have about eight restaurants uh, displaying food that you will be eating. And this is a big benefit uh, for Abilities Connection, which is located on the Aurora, Aurora campus where the old Lowry Air Force Base was. And Abilities Connection is a school, think of it that way, for people that have less abilities than you and I do mm -hmm. to help them get jobs, to get back on their feet. And it could be autism, it could be cerebral palsy, it could be MS, MD. Think of anything you know, where you may <clears throat> be impacted by a physical disability. And through the Kelly Smith Employment Center, they will help you get back on your feet and get into the workforce as well. And we've been part of this. It used to be strictly for cerebral palsy of Colorado, but mm -hmm. we've uh, broadened this through Abilities Connection. Big event. That's amazing. That means that it's doing really well if you're able to broaden it like that. So not only are you going to get to sample a bunch of wine and food, you're going to be doing some good for the community. Uh, some great community and some good entertainment. In fact, the theme this year is Elvis. We will have an Elvis impersonator there as our entertainment. Plus, That's we'll exciting. Have, we'll have dancing. <laughs> we have the usual silent auction. We have verbal auction. Uh, Mike, Margaret, and Kelly Smith and their families will be there. And Mike and Margaret started this event 35 years ago which we're proud to say that, yeah. again, we're hosting at the Keystone Conference Center. Yeah, major props to them and to you guys. That's right. So if you're wanting to go, you know, it sounds like a very fancy, formal event, but then you've also got Elvis, so what are we supposed to wear? Well, <laughs> you know, that's the most important thing. What am I, how Since do, entertainment how is Elvis, in? I'm sure we'll find some of our attendees uh, looking like Elvis as well. Yeah, but trying for to people like yourself, us. <laughs> the ladies will always be dressed to the nines in their mm -hmm. cocktail dresses. Uh, gentlemen, you'll see everything from the uh, black, tuxes, to suits, to sports coats, to sweaters. Uh, you know, it's an upscale event, but uh, you'll feel comfortable no matter what you come in. Yeah. Summit County formal. It <laughs> is Summit County saying. formal. Exactly. So uh, let's go over date. What about times? And it's at the Keystone Conference Center. It is at the Keystone Conference Center, and the Wine of the Pines event is on the 20th, Saturday the 20th. You can buy tickets at wineofthepines.org online or go visit Mike's operation at Dillon Ridge Liquor Store right here uh, next to City Market in Dillon. Both very easy places to get your tickets at because I'm right. online often, I'm at Dillon Ridge Liquors often. Right. <laughs> uh, just saying, all right, well, Steve, I'm ready for this event so much that I wanted it to be this coming weekend, but two <laughs> weekends, I guess I can wait another one to head over to there and this Elvis impersonator, I'm really excited You can for plan that ahead. Too. Make sure Plan I'm going to give you that Everyone. suit. Yeah, put <laughs> this on, on your the right refrigerator. Day. Yeah, I'll show up in a cocktail dress. <laughs> That's right. Like with a wine glass. Where is it? What's going on? <laughs> and I'll get a phone what call. Steve, is? we've got yeah. a lady at the conference center standing outside. <laughs> All right. So in two weekends coming up, wine right. in the pine. So you guys have a little bit of time to pick out your attire. If That's going to be the Elvis suit or Summit County Farmall. So we'll see you there, wineinthepines.org. Steve, thanks so much for coming on today and giving Thank us you. all this great info. It's a very great event. Can't wait. It's a wonderful event. Okay, we still have some more exciting things for you on Summit Sunrise Live this morning. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this.